Evening and all. Yeah. I'm having a night off tonight, talking about the dogs and the domes. Yeah, and all the rest of that business. And the Great Flood. And the Fire of London. And the plague. And all these other things. Do you know, in, in a, there's a, an Iron Maiden track. It's called a dream of actually. It's called a dream of mirrors. Yeah. A dream of mirrors. And I think it's on the Brave New World album, um, which has the front cover is the Thames uh, going through London, a serpentine stretch with the wiggles in it with the Millennium Dome and it's got Tower Bridge in the foreground and then it's got like the Dome and the Isle of Dogs and the cities and it. but it's all been remade it's all been re-sculpted there's all new buildings there and everything it's all different but it's the same river but the Tower Bridge is still there and on the album cover I'll insert it so you can have a quick look So, I'm just there, and I'm just watching that and thinking about that and all the rest of it. And then I thought to myself, you know, tonight, I'm going to have a break from talking about all of that stuff. And I'm just going to be eclectic, yeah. Because just recently I've really been getting into my old comedy series and old drama series and stuff like that with, you know, zero political correctness and zero fucking matriarchal orders and rules and shit back in the day, yeah, and I'm loving it. I'm loving living back in the day. I'm thinking when I move house, yeah, which I'm going to have to sooner or later, to, I'm going to keep my whole house out. Yeah. All like late 70s to mid 80s, decor everywhere. And anything that has to be modern is, is going to be like slightly camouflaged and stuff, you know. So, and I'm just, when you walk into my yard, it's going to be like walking into the past, yeah, the good times of this, of this phase of this cycle, which are long gone now. Yeah, but fuck it, I'm going to recreate it. Yeah, I'm going to recreate it. And talking of which, right. Thinking about going to the cinema back in the day. Can you remember going to the cinema back in the day? You know, maybe getting a date with a girl or something, or going with some of your mates from school and seeing what go on and that. Yeah, just go and watch whatever's on. You know, whatever the media has convinced you to go and see. But anyway, you know. But don't get me wrong. There was some good shit back in them days. You know, as well. Certainly better than there is now. To a larger degree. It's been a long time since, since we've seen something like the original Star Wars, you know, or the original Raiders of the Last Ark, or, you know, something really fucking groundbreaking. But there have been good movies made, don't get me wrong, but they're not groundbreaking, are they? You know? Now they're all getting too computerified, aren't they? And there's too many, too much CGI and computer effects and stuff, and it just looks like a computer game. In fact, Thinking about it, some of the computer games now, if you've got the right graphics card and whatnot, and you're running it really fast frames, they look more realistic than that some actual fucking films do. You know, and that's another agenda for another day, isn't it? Definitely. It really is. But on the subject of going to the cinema, yeah, the other day I was in the shop and uh I saw these. Now, anyone in the UK who went to the cinema, yeah, as a kid or whatever, a teenager, you always used to have puppets, didn't they, in all of them? Puppets with the ones, weren't they? Like, I've got mint chocolate ones here. They're not real chocolate. They taste cheap as fuck, yeah. But that eclectic taste, taste of cheapness, you know, is what I'm loving. So 
So in a bit, I'm going to watch something from that period. I've got two packets of these, yeah? All right? And a packet of munchies as well. <laughs> Remember them? All right? And I'm going to watch some like, eclectic and just chill out. Right, I'll roll a fatty. And just remember what fucking times used to be like. Because they're fucking a lot better than they are right now, aren't they? That, that was the day. That we've seen it. That's our peak, it's gone. The next peak ain't coming for a while. I don't think it's going to come in my lifetime. So, we might as well just fucking, you know think about the past and just dwell there because it ain't getting no better in a bit 